Good day everyone, this is Chris with the Ancient Scholar, and today what I'd like to do is I'd like to introduce you to one of the newer uh, devices that uh, that have kind of appeared on the, at least in the United States, this has been out in uh, Europe for a couple of years, uh, with the U.S. market, this is a new uh, type of what's known as a supraglottic airway device, it's uh, somewhat similar to the old laryngeal mask airway, or the LMA, and this is a device known as the eye gel, okay? And the eye gel is a rather unique device in that it is one of the few devices out there that it, you do not have an inflatable cuff. There is no inflatable cuff to the device. So what I'll do is I'll take it out of its holder here. <coughs> Excuse me. It has a very similar construction to the LMA, um, with the exception, with a couple of different exceptions. The first being that it has a very hard uh, bite block area here. Um, so the airway is not obstructed by the teeth or by biting. Um, it also has a little port here that allows you to pass a gastric tube, and then the, if you look at the tip here, um, you can pass a gastric tube into the stomach and do gastric decompression. In addition to that, it has the cuff, which is not inflatable, but it has a very malleable, soft material that seals um, around the structures of the airway. Um, you can see it has this little little flap here that actually holds the epiglottis up and out of the way so the epiglottis doesn't flop down and obstruct um, the airway aperture. So the way that they recommend inserting this airway is by putting a little bit of lubricant in here and you go ahead and you lubricate this, this, and this and then you go to your airway and Un, and it's inserted similar to the LMA, however, you do not have to stick your hand or fingers inside of the patient's airway. You just go ahead and position the patient, insert, following the hard palate down, insert into the mouth, and you insert until you meet definitive resistance. And if uh, you look down here, there's a little line here, and the teeth of the lip should generally line up with that marker there. And then you simply attach a bag valve device in capnography and what have you and you begin ventilating the patient. As you can see I have bilateral um, chest or lung rise and fall there and uh, that airway was inserted very rapidly, very easily, very quickly. You can go ahead and insert your gastric tube decompress the uh, stomach as well. So that's one of the newer uh, we call superglottic airway devices